Okay, so what you're about to hear, I don't recommend you try on VATSIM. Uh, so what I did before I took off, I set uh, First Officer's uh, procedure to RNAV, and then I set the runway, which in this case was 15. I think it was 15... just 15. Uh, so you set your runway, whatever it is, and you can set your takeoff runway, which is actually, I Landing believe, going to be the first Speed break arm. Uh, box after the... Um, Engine start switches. Continuous. Uh, Landing gear. After the uh, import flight Flaps. time, because I, they look actually the same as Checklist my takeoff complete. runways for my uh, airport that I was taking off from. Anyway, so what I did, I was slowing down about 10 knots at a time, from about 170, and then about maybe 10 miles out to 160, and then about 5 miles out I slowed down to about 5 knots above my VRF Flaps speed, 40. which was in my case right now 145. My altitude was set to zero. Well, first I set my altitude to 2500, because that was my initial approach fix for the RNAV. And then I set it to zero, and then uh, at about 50 feet. Now, I'm not, I haven't, um, I can't get this to happen all the time, but at 50 feet, I heard LDEV off, VNEV off, and uh, I heard in my ear AP disconnect, which you will not hear. And then um, I just uh, um, idled, and it did the rest. We landed at about a minus uh, 300 something, as you'll see. LNAV off. Be nav off. 30. 20. 10. Reverse thrust. One hundred knots. Eighty knots. Sixty knots. Reverse idle. Manual braking. <laughs> 